Well, hello there, y'all. We have just received our TB500, BPC157, and Thomas and Alpha 1 via nasal spray or oral use. You can do either one um, for your research purposes. These are not for human consumption. They're not to be eaten. They're not to be snorted. They're not to be banged. These are only for research. Now, if you're like me and I have a fish frog, monkey mouse, saber tooth, spider cricket, and he, my friends, does a lot of research. But understand that a human cannot use these unless he is advised by his medical professional and he gives him the okay. In that case, then he could be part of a clinical trial or if he's going to use them anyway, it is advised that he goes to his medical professional, gets blood work done, and always um, report findings so that the medical professional knows that whatever happened, he can give credit where it's due. So, nonetheless, if you will. Now, Here's the thing, is BPC-157 has been used for a long, 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 long time. And it has been used in other countries. TB-500, BPC-157, and Thymus and Alpha-1 are approved in other countries besides the United States, which we also ship to, um, for medical use. Just not in this place where I live. So I can ship to them for medical use, but not you. You can't use this. But in the research done... BPC-157 uh, is your faster healing reduction in inflammatory response. And the reason in, to reduce inflammation is important is not just for pain. Granted, inflammation pushes against the nerve that causes pain in your knees and joints and things. But think about this. Throughout the cardiovascular system, your veins and your arteries, the arteries have small muscles that run around them, right? These muscles help the heart to pump by squeezing and releasing. Now, when you get inflammatory response around the veins or the arteries, but mainly the arteries, it pushes against there. When that inflammation pushes against that arterial wall, it causes less and less blood flow. This is a literally like kinking a water hose, except for it would be more like stepping on it slowly. So the inflammation pushes against that and can cause higher blood pressure, hardening of the art or not hardening of the arteries, but cracked and bleeding arterial walls that causes blockages. It causes a lot of the issues due to cardiovascular disease. Now, insulin balance, BPC-157 has been shown to work so well at balancing insulin that they overdose mice to the point of almost death with insulin and then they give them BBC-157 and it perfectly regulates them. That means, taken regularly, this will not decrease insulin sensitivity, but it does show to balance insulin. Now, with that said, most of the issues from diabetes come from too much insulin. Insulin causes the hardening of the arterial walls. It causes the uh, breakdown of the cardiovascular system, and it is the reason that your kidneys and your heart give out before you die of anything else. It is the culprit for most deaths with type 1 diabetes. I mean, besides sugar. Um, but just like too much sugar causes problems, too much insulin causes problems too. Yeah, you lose weight. Yeah, you look good, but yeah, you die early because you become frail and brittle, and that can be mitigated, in theory, with BP or in animals for damn sure, with BPC-157. Now, it also makes you more sensitive to growth hormone, meaning growth hormone and insulin actually fit the same receptor, which is probably why it balances insulin so well as it opens up those receptors. Now, that is simply and truly a theory of mine. I have zero proof, but it would make logical sense in the body. And moving forward, um, it helps the tendons to repair more quickly, probably due to the GH receptors and the fact that it is helping the gut to function properly, which 
increases nutrient partitioning, which will in turn help you to heal. I mean, it's just how it works. Um, it helps with digestion of all kinds, from bloating to um, gastrointestinal diseases like leaky gut. Um, leaky gut. Blood pressure, it helps to, with blood pressure probably due to the anti-inflammatory response that the body gets, which is systemic and not localized. It will not inhibit you from building muscle like a corticosteroid, but more will mitigate heart disease. Um, liver protector, I'm not sure exactly how it does that, but wow, pretty cool, because it has been shown to even help people with hepatitis. And, um cirrhosis it doesn't turn them around by any stretch of the imagination but it helps other medications that they use for those to work more properly it helps with um, irritable bowel syndrome remember BPC 157 is originally found in the gut that's where it starts and then it goes into the bloodstream from there it's actually produced by the liver if I'm not mistaken I've, I've been wrong once before but I think it uh, may be produced by the liver and then from there it goes in the gut and the bloodstream or the colon. Um, now, heart health. If we're trying to keep our heart healthy, the product called Heart, which Dr. Matthias Rath was the one who came up with the idea. Actually, he did 12 years worth of studies proving he could reverse heart disease in any person. And he thought he was going to be wildly famous, but he didn't use a drug, so they banned him from giving speeches to the doctors, and here we are. But that product right over there, Heart, by um, Nutritional Healthcare Trivarin, that taken with BPC-157 would be amazing to help restore heart health. If there's an endocrine issue with it, Restore helps to restore the balance in the endocrine system where it gives the, body's, the body the raw material necessary to do so. Um, MSM plus C is a lubricant to the joints. It helps in balancing and breaking down all the foods properly. It helps with acid reflux, indigestion, heartburn, high anal hernia. Oh, by the way, the products that are for human consumption down here, these are to get the results of that if you can't take that, or you could take them together to get even better results if you could take this, but you cannot take this. Or these right here. The ones in black, cannot take. So, nonetheless, the heart and MSM will help to balance the cardiovascular system so that, well, in theory, you would get better from heart disease, like level your cholesterol out and get rid of the blockages in the arterial walls, but I can't say that. I've seen it happen in um, research. IBS helps to restore the colon by putting elasticity back in there Someone could use MSM, regular fruit and veg, and MPS-70 if they have an autoimmune disorder to help restore the colon back to health. In diabetes, Sugar Shocker MSM, Sugar Shocker is going to be 72 different ingredients that are all combined to regulate A1C, um, insulin, help the pancreas to restore blood flow and affect every single aspect of diabetes that insulin causes. So it's something to support everything if you're taking insulin to offset the bad effects there, which is exactly what BPC-157 does, right? So they complement each other rather well. Um, trim is going to be help with insulin sensitivity and actually help you to build muscle um, while burning fat for energy, which AOD, 90, that works too. I3C with DM clears the receptor sites, kind of like BPC-157 to make you more sensitive for insulin. Vitamin D is vastly important when you have diabetes. Other chemicals, TB500 can go in conjunction with BPC-157 like all the time. If you want to, if you have a need for muscle recovery, faster wound healing, endurance, things like that, if you could take it, but this is not for human consumption. I would never take this stuff, like, honestly, unless my doctor told me I could, which he does, so I love him. Um, is that YouTube friendly? God, I hope so. Um, nonetheless, so you've got pain. MSM plus C relief and MPS 200X are all great at dealing with pain. If you're in a state that Kratom is legal, That'll help too. Don't like I've heard some people say they're addicted to it. Look, man, it's gonna be a day or two you can feel it crap. We'll do a video on that later. 
Um, MSM plus C, Relief, and MPS 200X if you have autoimmune disorder. Relief is an anti-inflammatory COX-2 inhibitor to aid in reduction of inflammation systemically. Um, TB500, TA1, and M uh, MK2866 are also research chemicals that may help with pain and the aspects that you deal with there. Remember, BBC157, TB500, TA1, um, all these cannot be absorbed unless by in, unless directly injected because your stomach acid will kill them or the liver will filter them out unless using cyclodextrin. The BPC157 is the and is the one that kind of counters that because it will work all the way down into the stomach and colon, but it's still not getting past the liver into your bloodstream. Ain't gonna happen unless um, it is mixed with cyclodextrin. Cyclodextrin is your Trojan horse into the bloodstream for all of those. So you can find all that at newsongs.com. I hope that helps. Love y'all. Peace.